Governor Phil Murphy and members of his education cabinet announced their new student bill of rights aimed at improving higher education for New Jersey students. And they say it's the first comprehensive student-focused education plan in state's history. During the announcement at Rutgers Newark campus, Governor Murphy read what each of the 10 steps would accomplish. To their needs of accessibility and affordability, to their need for better information when making decisions regarding where to go to school, including the real costs, to their need for supportive campuses and faculty and staff. Governor Roy Cooper was in Kernersville yesterday where he signed an executive order. The order will increase opportunities for fair wages, employment and careers for people with disabilities. We believe this will improve our workforce. Studies show that the more diverse your workforce is, the better it is and more productive it is. More than 1.3 million North Carolinians have a disability. That's about 13 percent of the state's population. Oregon has permanently banned offshore drilling. Governor Kate Brown signed a measure today to extend a temporary 10-year ban that was set to expire next year. There is currently no oil production in the state. The measure also directs state agencies not to assist with any potential drilling operations in federal waters off the Oregon coast. Brown said the move proves Oregon is taking a leadership role in preventing the erosion of core laws that protect our environment. Six other coastal states have passed similar bans and seven others are considering a similar action.